Hey everyone, welcome back to Jabara. So today I have another complete disaster clean with me. I hope y'all are ready for some motivation because I definitely have it for you in this video. If you're new here, then please feel free to subscribe, hit the like, share for me, comment. All that really helps my channel out. And I'm gonna go ahead and just show y'all the befores and then we'll get started on cleaning. So before we get started today guys, I wanted to talk to y'all about Adoric. This video is sponsored by Adoric and these are pillows that are tailor made for your neck. This is the box that it came in. It was um, sealed up really tight. It was air sealed and all that stuff. Um, it was rolled up and um, when it fluffs out, it just gets huge. It's really heavy. Um, it is the Adoric Bamboo Pillow Shredded Memory Foam. Um, it contains like modified memory foam filling and it also has polyester gel fiber. So it helps you feel cool um, on hot summer nights or whatever. Like it felt so good to sleep with it last night. Um, I'm so happy they sent it to me. The pillow cover is also uh, breathable and it's also washable. So you can take this off and wash it whenever you need to. Um, compared with other bamboos on the market, it adds about 400 grams more filling than others. Um, so it makes the pillow higher, which is really good for your spine. And also low pillows cause um, an insufficient blood supply to the brain so it's good to have like a higher pillow and this one is pretty high but it's so comfortable i am in love with it so i'm probably going to end up ordering my husband one we wanted to try it first and see if we really liked it and i really liked it i might let him try it tonight i might let him try it tonight i don't know i'm kind of in love with it so anyway um, if y'all have a chance and y'all are looking for new pillows, I highly recommend them. Um, like I said, I wouldn't tell y'all anything that I didn't like. I wouldn't, you know, work with somebody that I didn't care for, but it's amazing. Um, like, look at how thick it is. Like, it's really thick and heavy and it's just, it's such a nice pillow. So anyway, I'm going to have everything linked below for y'all to go check them out. And also, if you use the link below, it is an affiliate link and I do make a commission on that. So here we are in the kitchen and I'm just going to go ahead and start in here. I had a ton of dishes to do. I have boxes everywhere, a lot of stuff to throw away. The floors were filthy. So I'm just going to go ahead and wash the dishes really quick and then we will wipe the counters down wipe the appliances down and clean the floors, all that good stuff. And then we'll be heading to the living room. I have been keeping y'all out of my dining room because I am in the process of remodeling or well, not remodeling it. I'm just changing some things up in there. I can't wait for y'all to see it. I hope y'all like it. And so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and throw on some music and we're going to get this place cleaned up. So on my last video, a lot of y'all said that y'all like that I'm slowing it down a little bit. So I'm working on that. And also y'all want me to talk more. I have no idea what y'all want me to talk about. So leave me some questions down in the comments and I'll start answering them in my next videos. Sometimes I ask questions or I let y'all ask me questions over on Instagram and I'll answer them here. But if y'all want to know anything, just leave it down below in the comments. 
I had a bunch of stuff on the island there. I have been working on stuff for the dining room. And yeah, I am for Christmas this year, I am going with the uh, black and white buffalo plaid check, whatever it's called. Um, so anyway, I was just adding some stuff in there. Like I said, I can't wait for y'all to see the dining room. It is not done yet. I'll probably have it done within the next couple of days. And then it will be on videos coming up. So I'm excited for y'all to see that. Um, it's nothing big, but I did change a few things up and we really like it so far. So whenever I clean the kitchen, I like to dry everything and put it away. I just don't like anything out on the counters once I'm done cleaning. It, I just have to feel the full effect of the kitchen being clean. I don't know why I don't like any clutter or anything on the counters once I'm done with it. Doing what you do, doing what you do. Just keep on doing what you do, doing what you do. So let me know down below how many of y'all clean along with me or how many of y'all just chill and watch. Does this get you motivated and does it relax you? It a lot of time a lot of times it relaxes me to watch somebody else clean their house. Let me know about you down in the comments. But baby, I saw you for a second and I'm happy that you came my way Don't wanna waste no time without you ever brightening up my days Never meant to fall so hard Baby, I saw you for a second and I'm happy that you came my way. 
and I'm just using vinegar and water to clean the counters. I do love using vinegar and water. It leaves it really clean. It doesn't leave a residue behind like some cleaning products do. And also I just like to step away from the strong chemicals sometimes. everything that I was using to do my projects it will all end up back out here but I do like to clean it up and just get a fresh start just so the mess doesn't get too out of control and then I don't have any area to work so I'm just gonna put everything away and then eventually I'll bring most of it back out Coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out. So try not to hold me down, feel alive. Faster car. 
So now we're finally in the living room and it was just pretty much messy. The kids kind of throw everything everywhere and I just needed to tidy up, wipe a few things down and get it back together. So I'm going to do that really quick and then we'll be, um, well, it took me a couple of days to actually do this. It usually happens like this. I'll clean the living room and the kitchen and the pantry and all that good stuff and then I'll end up cleaning the bedrooms the next day that's just how it always happens but anyway I'm gonna go ahead and just get as much done as we can <laughs> Sinking deeper every day And lately I am missing my reflection And every muddy puddle on the pavement Driving every thought into distortion to give y'all a close-up of the floors I know sometimes it's hard to tell that they're even dirty in the video but up close and personal they they're always filled with stuff especially with the baby <laughs> I don't need that type of drama And trying to be tough for the daytime You try to make yourself feel better by taking me down Once I fell but now I'm strong I'm ready for the rematch Shoot me down, don't you know Look 
looking at me so cold Get over yourself, are you for real? Why well, are you looking at me so cold? One's love is now we're enemies You try to make yourself feel better by taking me down Once I fell but now I'm strong, I'm ready for the rematch my floors I'm just using the original pine saw
So we're just about done with the floors, guys, and then we're going to head over to the master bedroom and the master bathroom. I won't make it easy for you now. So here we are. It is the next day, and like I said, this usually happens. I have four kids all the way from 18 years old to two years old. So I am getting stopped constantly. I Sometimes it's frustrating, but for the most part, I'm just enjoying it while I can. I just, it's hard to get everything done in one day. I could definitely do it if I had a sitter for that day because I wouldn't have any interruptions. But when you have kids, you get stopped a lot. And then by the time you know it, you're just exhausted from cleaning what you can and doing whatever they need you to do when you have to cook, you have to do school. I help the oldest. He has his own YouTube channel. Y'all should go check it out. I link it below in every single one of my videos. He is a, he's a musician. He just graduated high school and he's taking the year off before he goes to college and he's just working on his music. So I would love it if y'all would go check him out. But anyway, yeah, it just, there's a lot going on here all the time, every day. My house is loud. Um, so, yeah, it's it's just always something going on. And I don't really break too easily, but I'm worth it. Cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight. Oh, so give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars. Oh, I'll stick like glue inside your mind. Just watch me break in your sweat You're falling into me, touch me I swear You would do anything that I want So keep us awake till the dawn Ooh, Baby, feel free I wanna make you sweat on me I wanna make you sweat on me Watch me break in Man. 
nails done since the whole COVID thing. I've just been buying the Kiss nails and gluing them on. Well, the other day, some of the glue spilt on here and I was freaking out and I was like asking my husband, how am I going to get it off? And he was like, just use a razor blade. Calm down. It's not going to hurt anything. So thank God it worked. Um, it freaked me out because I do not want to mess up the counters. And yeah, so that's what I was doing there. I was just scraping off the glue. Don't need no therapist. There's nothing like, nothing like wine. I'm not calling 
gonna tell you what to do How to make me fall for you You should learn that on your own I play cool, cause I hope you pick it up soon And you know just what to do Don't you? Boy, just be honest Okay, if y'all have hung with me this long, you're like a champ because this video is so, so long. I had a ton of laundry built up. I can wash clothes, dry clothes. It, when it comes to putting clothes away, I hate it. I don't know why. It's just my most hated chore in the whole house. And it seems like every time I get rid of clothes, we get three times as many clothes back. I don't know what it is. So anyway, I just had a ton of laundry to get done and I had to speed this up because it took forever. I hope you pick it up soon And you know just what to do Don't you Boy, just be honest
This video is so long, my computer is literally getting mad at me. We are almost done, and then I'm going to give you all those satisfying after shots. If you have hung around for this long, I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. But anyway, um, yeah, we're almost there, guys. This is the last room. Okay guys, we are finally done. I'm gonna show y'all some satisfying afters. I hope y'all like this hour long clean with me. Um, and yeah, don't forget to check out the pillow. I wouldn't recommend it if I didn't love it. And yeah, I love you all. Take care of each other and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.